Hello Pisces, welcome to your weekly reading. So we're going to take a look at the next 72 hours and see what you can anticipate. This is a timeless read, so whenever you click on the video, that's when the messages can resonate the most. The energy um, is also general, so not everything is going to apply. Just take what does and leave the rest. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, as well as Jupiter. So please make sure to check your other placements. Um, your other placements could resonate more than your sun sign actually your sun sign may not even resonate at all so that's why it's good to look at your other placements let's tap in spirits give me some energy for pisces next 72 hours messages for pisces next 72 hours what is the energy what would you like for pisces to know next 72 hours okay the page of wands so there's some type of communication coming in six of swords somebody could be saying that they're leaving they're moving on they're walking away whoever's leaving though with this six of swords like they're being guided away from a situation um something may be bittersweet I feel like spirit is definitely carrying someone in this new season. For some of you, there could be multiple things that you're walking away from. A lot of cycles that are closing, but it's only to prepare you for better, for greater opportunities here, Pisces. Yeah, from a new, for a new beginning, page of wands, a new start. I feel like you're going to be very um, satisfied with this new beginning. For some of you, you're very ambitious. Let's go ahead and pull some more energy. Spirit, tell me why... Is the page of wands here for pisces what is the energy why is the page of wands here for pisces what is the message what would you like for pisces to know at this time what would you like for pisces to know at this time what is the energy what would you like for pisces to know what is the message the full yep take that leap pisces Aquarius energy, tell me more about the Page of Wands. Why is the Page of Wands here for Pisces? Eight of Cups, yeah, this is about you moving on. You're closing out a major cycle, a major life cycle for you. There's about to be some very significant changes. I'm hearing like underway. So again, it may be a sad period for you um, because you have to leave certain people or a certain person behind. But like I said, there's better. Like God is going to give you a better opportunity. Um, I'm also hearing um, the gospel song, he saw the best in me when everyone else around could only see the worst in me. So for some of you, this could be people or a person who like, I'm hearing like downplays you, um, who only looks at your faults and never really look at what you bring to the table. They can only see the bad and never recognize the good in you, never give you your flowers. And so you're going somewhere where you can receive that you can receive your flowers give me an energy for the fool why is the fool here for pisces what is the message why is the fool here for pisces what is the energy i have the page of swords and the king of swords i'm hearing lack direction for some of you Somebody could feel like you don't know what you're doing. You're not making a, a proper decision, but you are. For some of you, you could have someone in your life or people in your life that just want you to do what they want you to do. But no, that's not how God the divine works. Give me an energy for the King of Swords. Why is the King of Swords here? I also feel like you're going to be cutting a lot of people off. Again, something has to do with you um, closing out a lot of cycles. I have the Ace of Cups and the King of Pentacles. For some of you, um, you're going to be making a decision pertaining to a love offer, who it is that you want to commit to. Something has to do with travel as well, relocation. Give me an energy for the Ace of Cups. Why is the Ace of Cups here for Pisces? What is the energy? Oh, wow, I have three cards. The devil in the reverse, six of pentacles in the reverse, and the hangman. Um, Pisces, your energy on the hangman, Capricorn on the devil. So somebody, um, be careful, Pisces. Make sure that you're not choosing to invest in a karmic cycle. 
you're not choosing a lesson over a blessing because you're not going to get what you deserve out of the situation it's going to be very one-sided make sure that you are making a practical decision and you're not rushing into anything because something's really not going to pay off for you if you choose this path it's like you're coming with the ace of cups and this person is bringing in this devil energy in the reverse. I'm hearing like won't give it up. So this is somebody who doesn't even want to change. They don't even really see the error in their ways. Somebody um, doesn't know how to accept accountability. So be very mindful of who you choose to give to. Give me an energy for the hangman in the reverse. Why is the hangman in the reverse here for Pisces? What is the energy? Why is the hangman in the reverse here for Pisces? What is the message? Page of Cups. Yeah, because you know what? Something has to do with the friend. For some of you, you could have been like overly committed to a friend or just your friendships in general. People who really are disingenuous, they don't care about you. They only want to take from you. They don't want to give back. I'm hearing like replenish. Yeah, it's like by the time you give everything, you have nothing left for yourself. And you're not able to replenish because ain't nobody pouring back into you. Give me an energy for the King of Pentacles. Why is the King of Pentacles here for Pisces? What is the message? Why is the King of Pentacles here for Pisces? What is the energy? Why is the King of Pentacles here? I have the world, Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius energy. So there's a cycle here that is about to end. Change. I feel like your reading is all about change. Give me an energy for the King of Pentacles. Why is the King of Pentacles here for Pisces? What is the energy? I have the Queen of Cups. Tell me more about the world. Why is the world here? For some of you too, somebody's going to be finding out that a child is not theirs or the possibility of a child not being theirs. Give me an energy for the world. It's like people could be talking about this. I'm hearing news, so a lot of gossip. Something could also be playing out on the internet. Why is the world here for Pisces? What is the energy? Why is the world here? The chariot. Somebody's deciding to move forward. Cancer energy. And not look back. Somebody could be closing out a cycle with a cancer or somebody that has it highly aspected with this Queen of Cups chariot energy. Tell me more about the Page of Swords. I have the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. So somebody is extremely codependent. Whoever you're walking away from is very codependent. Somebody needs assistance when it comes to their finances, their stability. Give me an energy for the Page of Swords. Why is the Page of Swords here for Pisces? What is the energy? Okay, so I have the Eight of Pentacles. This is somebody who don't like to work. They barely like to work. Somebody could like um, switch jobs a lot. It's like they'll work sometimes and then the other times they just, somebody's lazy. They don't like to do much. They don't like to put in a lot of effort. For some of you, I feel like the only reason why this person um, even chooses to work or do anything is to, um, I'm hearing let's give them something to talk about. So this is something that you could have been mentioning to this person, what they need to do, what you want them to do when it comes to the relationship. And so that's the only reason they do it. So they don't have to hear you, hear your mouth and actuality. They don't want to do it at all. It's just to shut you up pretty much. So, you know, you won't talk about them. People won't talk about them, but they, they really just want to be provided for and then i have the moon and the king of wands sideways so heavy cancer energy heavy on your energy as well pisces um i feel like you're thinking about leaving or this could be going on with somebody that's energetically tied to you it's like somebody wants to leave and somebody also wants people to know about what they've been experiencing but it's giving me like um, one foot in, one foot out, lukewarm. 
is like somebody will be right there and then they would, you know, revert back. Somebody wouldn't actually take that leap. Um, give me an energy on the King of Wands. Somebody wants to expose what's going on, but then again, they don't. Somebody keeps questioning themselves. Somebody wants to leave, but then they don't. I feel like there's an element of fear. Lukewarm. Give me an energy for the King of Wands. Five of Pentacles. You know why you won't leave or why this person won't fully leave this situation? Because they are concerned about this um, Queen of Cups finances. Her stability or his stability. This could be a masculine operating in his femininity. Somebody knows that this person is like in between jobs. You know, their career really isn't stable. And they want to walk away. But they're concerned about what's going to happen to this person once they do. Give me an energy for the Eight of Cups. The number eight could be significant with the Eight of Cups. Eight of Pentacles. The number 88. Eight of Swords into a Pentacle. Somebody stuck. Somebody stuck in their head. They keep going back and forth about leaving. Because they're concerned about the other person. Um, give me an energy for the Eight of Swords. Why is the Eight of Swords here for Pisces? What is the message? Why is the Eight of Swords here for Pisces? What is the energy? The Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, this is somebody that you committed to or that this person committed to. For some of you, there is a marriage here. I'm telling you, somebody takes care of someone. Somebody is a provider. Give me an energy for the Eight of Swords and another eight. So, eight, eight, eight. So, look up 88 and then 888 for someone. I think I got this number for another reading. I believe it was for Leo. Give me an energy for the Eight of Swords. Why is the Eight of Swords here? For Leo or Aries? Death in the reverse. Yes. Like a Scorpio energy. Somebody keeps a cycle open. It, and it's all for finances. Somebody really don't know how to manage well. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here for Pisces? What is the energy? Why is the Queen of Pentacles here for Pisces? Two of Swords. Somebody doesn't know what to do without the other person. The number two could be significant. Two of Swords, Two of Pentacles, the number 22. Why is the Two of Pentacles here? The Five of Swords. But listen, somebody keeps being hateful though. They keep want to argue. They keep want to fuss. Like somebody is very revenge seeking. For some of you, you try to block this person out, tune them out. Or they try to tune you out. The roles could be reversed. Somebody's been this way for a long time. But it's like they need you and you are considering, you know, their circumstances, but they come at you in this five of swords energy. Give me a message for the two of pentacles. Why is the two of pentacles here? The number five could be significant with the five of pentacles, five of swords, the number 55. Why is the two of pentacles here? What is the energy? Why is the two of pentacles here? What is the message? The 10 of pentacles. Cause somebody looking at you for abundance, they're looking at you as their way out from the material gain. That's why this person's so hateful. That's why this person will sabotage any other union or try to. That's why this person wants to compete so bad. I'm hearing music. Somebody could do something in music. The Magician. Virgo Gemini energy. Somebody's trying to manifest their way. Like somebody wants to have their way in this situation. For some of you too, this is somebody who could put on like a pity party, try to make you feel sorry for them or make this other energy feel sorry. For some of you too, this is a group of people that want to hold on to you. Like I said, something deals with multiple people for some of you that's just very manipulative, can be very hateful, but they don't have your best intentions at heart. And again, something depletes you. Six of Pentacles in the reverse. You are the giver in the situation, but never the receiver. Nobody ever pours back into you. Give me an energy for the Page of Wands. Why is the Page of Wands here for Pisces? What is the energy? Why is the Page of Wands here for Pisces? What is the energy spirit? The star. Listen, 
this new beginning, this new chapter, for some of you, you're going to move. Somebody's going to pick up and move. I'm hearing Arizona. That could be significant to someone. Um, or the letter A. Listen, it's faded for you to move on from this situation. I feel like time is up. Heavy Aquarius energy in this reading. Um, that's how you're going to be at peace. That's how you're going to find your happiness, your fulfillment. That's also how you're going to heal in this new cycle. You're going to have to leave something, someone, certain people behind. But you're being spiritually guided to do this. And I, something about this is bittersweet. Because you do have to walk away from people that you care about. That you genuinely love. But I'm telling you what you're getting is far greater. I'm hearing suspense. So it's like... um. The upside to this is that this is a new beginning. You don't know what to expect, but you know like this is a time where you get to start over and you get to rebuild. In this time, you get to have it your way. Like I feel like you've learned whatever you need to learn. I'm hearing vet. You know how to vet people. I'm hearing manipulation, you know, pay attention to the energies because of what you've been through. For some of you, you were highly manipulated in this other connections or these other connections where it's plural. Give me an energy for the Six of Swords. Why is the Six of Swords here for Pisces? What is the energy? Next 72 hours. Why is the Six of Swords here? Queen of Swords. Somebody's being told they're moving on. For some of you, you might not even be the, the deliverer of this information. I feel like this Queen of Swords is another energy and you're the Six of Swords. So somebody's going to be telling, oh wow, telling this person or these people that you are moving on. Somebody's literally going to be letting someone else know or this group of people know that you've left. Somebody is leaving. Give me another energy for the Queen of Swords. Why is the Queen of Swords here? The Knight of Pentacles. Whatever this is, is long term. It's very stable for you. I feel like you're being told to go. And it's been a long time coming. For some of you, you should have left a long time ago. I'm also getting like, are we there yet? Um, just know that whatever you're seeking after, it may have been a long road. But in the end, like when you reach your destination, it's going to be very stable for you. It's going to be secure, long term here, Pisces, Page of Pentacles. You just have to be willing to embrace the new. Um, let's pull a final message for you. Spirit, give me a final message for Pisces. What is the energy? Give me a final message for Pisces. What is the energy? Okay, I have appreciate all you have. Let go of how you think your life should be and celebrate all that it is. Needing nothing attracts everything. Exactly. What stands out to me is let go of how you think your life should be. Let go of like who you think should be in your life, who you think should remain. Like, Let all of that go. We're only here to experience people certain situations everything is temporary nothing is permanent that's what you need to realize and be grateful for everything you have and a lot of times too you have to be grateful for what you don't have because you never know what god what spirit is protecting you from so if something is not working out something's not coming together something's not falling in place it's for a reason a higher purpose and you may not see it at the time because you don't know everything. You don't know the ins and outs. But by and by, you will gain a greater understanding. The more you release, the more you let go of your expectations, the more you attract what it is that you really desire and what you really need in your life, Pisces, and who you really need in your life. So um, I just heard that beating. You probably did too. Something, again, I'm hearing TikTok time. Something deals with time. Everything happens when it's time. On arrival. Something, again, the number eight. Eight o'clock. Something eight o'clock. 
that, that time is significant, 8 o'clock. I'm not getting whether it's a.m. or p.m. I'm specifically getting the time 8 o'clock. And I'm hearing something about news. But this is your reading. Take what resonates. Stay true to thyself. Real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.